And if you drive that way to work daily, you know it's a problem. So much so that it's been named one of the top five truck bottlenecks for 2023. Good days, Brooke Zahner joins us now. And uh, it's just one of several spots, Brooke, that's made the list. Yeah, not, not any surprise. I don't think yeah, we even slowed our camera pandemic. down. Right. right. I know. You know, that happens periodically and you're like, huh? well, yeah, yeah. you know, <laughs> well, Atlanta unfortunately has six spots on the top 20. The American Transportation Research Institute compiled its list of 100 bottlenecks nationwide using data from trucking GPS. It looked at the impact that these bottlenecks have on the system that moves all of our goods and products across the country. The group hopes this research can help guide decisions on where to invest money to make our nation's transportation system run more smoothly. So you can see our map here to show you the locations of Atlanta's top six trouble spots and clearly traffic trouble uh, pretty much surrounding the perimeter on 285. That includes number four, Spaghetti Junction, number five, I-20 at 285 on the west side. No surprise, I-20 at 285 on the east side and then I-75 north right near the, Cl the Cobb Cloverleaf are also on that list. I-75 in McDonough, also number 13, followed by I-285 at Georgia 400. As many of you know, that's the site of a massive transformation happening right now. So crews have been closing lanes in that area as they work to complete that multi-million dollar project that's aimed at easing the congestion that's slowing down right now traffic even more. So for now, people just need to make sure they give themselves, as we tell you a lot, give yourself extra time, share the road with all of those trucks. But yeah, 285, it's interesting when you look... Mm. Mm -hmm. You know, during peak rush hour, it's always around the perimeter where it's just yeah. a headache. Yeah, it doesn't even matter, even if it's not during rush hour. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you never know. I, I travel that way on 85 yep. near Spaghetti Junction every day, yeah. twice a day, and, and no matter what time it is, it's still a trucks mess. everywhere. Yeah. Right. Yeah. A mess. It's unfortunate when it's on the weekends and you're like, really? I know. <laughs> yeah. Why is there traffic? <laughs> God, I'd be safe. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Thanks, Brooke.